Hey y'all, it's the Cincy Lady of East Texas. It's time for Bring Back My Bar Month. Yep, you've got it. There are 25 fragrances that have previously been discontinued, but were voted to come back, and they are back for this month only. They are $6 each, or buy five, get one free, as always, but there are pretty incredible options for you to choose from. And I'm here to share my personal opinion, not meant to sway you, just to let you know what I think about them. There are 25, so I am gonna break this up into two videos. The first video is gonna be fruity and foodie. And then the second video you'll have to catch because those are totally different options. So they are in no order as far as my personal favorites. I'm just going to run with it, but I'm going to be quick because again, these are only my personal opinions just to give you a little bit of a description, but I don't want to monopolize your time. So here we go. First up, we've got cashmere. I love cashmere. It is a, I would love to say it's a kind of a grandma scent, but I don't think so. Like it's not old lady perfume. It's incredible. <sighs> it's so nice. It's definitely perfumey and it would be perfect for a bedroom, bathroom, powder room, whatever. It's almost like the ultimate bubble bath fragrance. I think of like the old 80s and 90s commercials, Calgon Take Me Away. This is the scent that comes to mind. But again, it's not like super old lady perfumey. It's incredible. It's one of my favorites and I get so excited every time it comes back. Next, we have Pink Haze. These are so washed out for some reason. All right, Pink Haze. Oh, I love this scent. It's such a light and happy scent. It's almost like cotton candy, but y'all, when it's warm, major confession here, when it's warm, to me, it smells like Dr. Pepper. Like there is something in it that just smells sweet and bubbly and it legit, to me, smells like Dr. Pepper. It's so fun. It's so good for summer. Next, we have sugar. I love sugar. This was one of my all-time favorites from when I joined 10 years ago. It's such a happy, non-offensive fragrance. This one is so good for any space that you could possibly imagine. I sell it to a lot of realtors, a lot of places where the public is going to be because it's not in your face, it's light, it's fun, and everybody loves it. It's almost like sugar spun candy or cotton candy, but it's light, it's not sickly sweet. It's just a good fragrance that you can just have in the air and is not offensive to everybody. It's a bestseller and a personal favorite of mine. Next, we have bubble gum. This one is a little too sweet for me. It's almost like double bubble, um, but it's got some lemon in it, so it makes it a little more acidic and a little more stout. Um, it would be so fun in a kiddo's bedroom or even a kitchen um, or like a playroom or a classroom. It is super fun, but it is very, very strong and very sweet. But it literally is like the double bubble candy. Next, we've got Happy Birthday. Another really, really sweet fragrance, but oh y'all, it's like legit cake batter. I love this scent and I actually was warming this one time. It was the scent of the month and my husband came home from work and he was looking everywhere in the kitchen and I'm like, babe, what are you looking for? And he's like, the cake you baked. And I'm like, mm, I didn't bake a cake. It's wax in the Scentsy Warmer. And needless to say, he was not a happy camper because it totally smells like cake batter or a fresh baked cake. It is so good. Next, we have banana nut bread. Always a fan favorite. I do not like to eat banana nut bread, but I love to smell this fragrance. You literally can smell every single component. You can smell the vanilla, you can smell the bananas, you can smell the nuts, you can smell everything. It is such a good fragrance. And this is one of the very first fragrances that Scentsy ever uh, created and sold. So it's almost like nostalgic um, feeling, if you will, when it comes to that fragrance. Next up, we have Cherry Vanilla. 
This is a really, really good one. I, if you've been following me for long, you know that I typically don't like cherry fragrances. They remind me of cough syrup, but this one is so good. It's not sickly sweet, it's not medicinal. The vanilla really tones it down and makes it really, really good. It's not like a really foodie scent, so it's not gonna be like a cherry scone or a cherry anything, like, like cherry pie. It um, is definitely more fruity, <clears throat> excuse me, but it is so good. It's really, really good. Next up, we have Grape Granita. Too sweet for me. It's legit like a Grape Jolly Rancher or the Grape Nerds, which I do love Grape Nerds, but I'm just not sure that I want this in my house. It is sickly, sickly sweet. Uh, but for all you grape fanatics, it keeps coming back, so I know y'all are out there and y'all are excited that it's back. Next, we have Blueberry Rush. I love this one. I love blueberry cheesecake, but this is gonna be more like your fresh picked blueberry. This is gonna be more fruity, not foody, not sickly sweet. It's just good old blueberries that are picked from the patch. It's really good, ultimate for spring and summer. Next, we have Cherry Limeade. I do not like anything about this fragrance because it's sickly sweet and it's got lime. So my personal opinion, I can't stand it because I don't like lime. Also, if you've been following me for long, you know that. So, not meant anything against those that love it. It's just not a favorite of mine. Next, we have Beach. I like Beach, and if you followed, or if you caught my last Bring Back My Bar video when this was offered, I confessed that I did not like the way this smelt cold because it smelled like dead fish in the clamshell, but I finally caved one day and warmed a tester of it, and it's incredible. And now I can't get enough of it. It's got papaya in it, which is incredible warm, like y'all have no idea. This scent is life, and I cannot get enough of it. It is so good, and now I don't even smell dead fish in the clamshell, even when it's cold. So I feel like I've come a long way. And finishing out the first of two videos, I've got Jumpin' Jelly Bean. I love this scent. It is happy. It is springtime, summertime. It reminds me of like um, Green Apple Jolly Ranchers or Jelly Beans. It is so good. It's just a really, really sweet citrus, but it is always, always, always a favorite. It goes in every room, every space. It is really, really good. So there you have it. There's videos one of two. I'll be back shortly with the rest of the Bring Back My Bar collection.